Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to your faces now. In this video, it's going to be a different kind of video. Usually it'll be like a live commentary or uh, something like that. But no, here is how, like here are a few reasons on how Treyarch can bring back Who's Who. Because Who's Who wasn't that great in Die Rise and we didn't use it again. Like it was an untouched perk since Die Rise, which was the first DLC for Black Ops 2. If you guys did not know that, that's a bit of info for you. Now basically, how they could bring it back is make it like Quick Revive, sort of like Quick Revive 2.0 and um, basically remove Quick Revive because we all know there's going to be another Call of Duty Zombies game. We just know, I mean, from a business standpoint, it, it wouldn't make sense if they didn't bring Zombies back after Revelations. But here is how they can bring back Who's Who again. Now, back in World of War, Quick Revive was practically useless for Solo. It was ba basically the way Quick Revive works in co-op, that's the way it worked for um, for World of War. But then they gave it a bit of a buff, they changed it in Black Ops 1. And uh, yeah, now, one thing I will say about this is, this perk, sh like, if they do decide to go ahead with this, then they'd have to replace Quick Revive. Okay, right, basically let's get into it. Now here's the first way. Who's who, when you're down and you respawn, you respawn only with a pistol. Now for this, you'd respawn with the Mustang and Sally, which I think are now called Death and Taxes. You'd respawn with that and you would be given 60 seconds to find your body and revive yourself. When you start reviving yourself, then the timer will stop. So um, yeah, if you don't revive yourself, then uh, you'll respawn back to where you downed but it'll class as a down and it'll basically work like like you know once you down three times after you, when you quick revive quick revive disappears so where it would work if you get to your body within the 60 seconds and you revive yourself it doesn't class as a down or like it does class as a down and a revive but it doesn't class as a down from the quick revive from the who's who so um basically what i'm saying is if you don't get to your body and revive yourself, then it would still respawn you, but it'll class as one down, one out of three downs from your who's who perk. So, um, like that is what would happen, and I think that would be really, really good. So, you respawn, so you basically spawn in like on the other side of the map with the Mustang and Sally, and you'd have to, you'd have like 60 seconds or so, or like. Maybe we make it 30 seconds. 30 seconds to get to your original body and revive yourself. If you don't revive yourself, then you still respawn where you downed, except it would class as a down from the who's who, and you're given three who who's downs, and when you use all of them up, then you can't use the perk anymore. It disappears like Quick Revive would. So it's basically like Quick Revive 2.0. Now, I really do think that Treyarch could implement this in some way or another and I will tag them in the video um, so that each like so that when you like the video it sends out a tweak to Treyarch now I think it would really really work for the next installment of Zombies especially since uh, we've not been given that many perks in Black Ops 3 we've only been given one perk and um, yeah even though we're lying it's a really, really good perk we didn't get it in the DLC so we sort of missed out on that. So I'm hoping that in the next installment of Zombies, it gets rid of some perks. For example, maybe get rid of Electric Cherry and Deadshot and replace it with two new perks or one new perk or something like that. Because Deadshot is pretty much irrelevant for certain maps. It's helpful for certain strategies, but not that helpful. So I think that they should do something like add a new perk and. Uh, yeah, because Who's Who had a lot of potential, except, like, when it was teased and then when we actually saw it, we were thinking, oh my god, there's so much potential for this perk, yet we were sort of, um, like, we, saw, we, it, we were sort of overrated when it was teased, but was actually a really, really bad perk. So, that's something that they should do, definitely. But anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed this, this video, I can't even talk right now, then be sure to leave a like on it. And I'll catch you as well. But until next time, peace.